transparency that's come with gaining control of patient care, Costa claims to have found some alarming hospital practice. He believes angiograms were routinely ordered at the local hospital, partly because they're a source of income. You know full well that that bill is artificially boosted. So you think procedures are happening either carelessly or deliberately? That deliberately. Don't, that don't need to happen? Correct. So what, what, when, when we talk about the potential for saving, you, you think there's a huge potential for saving in, in, in the Idiot. NHS without harming the patient? Yes. The Secretary of State for Health and architect of the new reforms, Andrew Lansley, agrees with Costa that the current system can encourage this sort of wastage. Well, it can happen. And it happens because of the way the, the payment system in the NHS works at the moment, because it pays for activity. So, of course, if you incentivise somebody just to do more work, they'll do more work. What I'm talking about is, let's get to the point where what, we have, what the payment system focuses on is delivering quality and the results for patients. And that's a different matter, of course. Currently, PCTs pay hospitals a set tariff for most of the procedures they carry out. So if hospitals aren't rigorous in weeding out anything unnecessary, the potential for waste is huge. 